There it is. I found what we're looking for. Gee Willikers, the video just started and we've already found the body? Never mind. It was just a vine app. Something that's also dead and should stay dead. So you don't miss the vine app? No, no one does. Hi kids, who's ready to explore? That's right, motherfuckers, you are. Let's look for Thomas Jefferson's tomb. Inside contains a treasure not fit for one man. Well, maybe do. I honestly don't know. That's just what it said on Yahoo Answers. Yahoo's my favorite search engine. Oh, that and ask Jeeves. Okay, let's get to the mission, you fucking pieces of shit. Cool it with the words, okay? What? I'm trying to get them motivated. Normally I wear glasses, but I lost them in an ass crack at the strip club. Whose tomb are we looking for today? We are looking for the tomb of Thomas Jefferson, the 41st president of the United States. Did you major in history? Of course. That's why I'm an explorer. The first cave I came out of was my mother's Womb. The first tunnel I came out of was my father's. That's right, I used to swim. I swam out of his penis. There was a bunch of other swimmers, but I was the only one that survived. I killed them all off. Is there something cool inside the tomb? Apparently, Tom Tom liked to stay icy. Icy? Is it cold in there or something? No, he has jewelry. It's what the World Star kids are saying instead of jewelry. Icy. Icy. He's so icy that his neck doesn't like him. That boy Tom. That boy Tom Tom, I see. You know what they say about explorers? Big penises. My feet are killing me. You said we'd be there like an hour ago. Well, according to my map, we're almost there. It's like a 47 mile span. Good thing there's two of us. Covers twice as much ground. Why are you getting so close to me? What happens in the wilderness stays in the wilderness. I don't believe in modern medicine. I've had gonorrhea 17 times. Can you tell us about one of your exploration secrets? Have you ever heard of North Korea? Yeah. That was a science experiment gone wrong. I don't want to put that one in the video. Oh, why? You think they're going to see it? I have a big channel. Wow, you're really patting yourself on the back with that one. Joe has an ego. You'll never be as good as David Dobrik. <laughs> These are the steps that Rocky climbed up in Rocky 7. This is the water fountain they use in the diaries of Anne Pussystack. This is where Ryan lost his virginity in shaving Ryan's privates. Have you ever heard of the Liberty Bell? Heard of it. I cracked it. That was you? Yeah, me and Nicolas Cage back in 1965. There were hookers, there were drugs, Twisted Sister was playing. The 70s were crazy in the 60s. <laughs> I also made the Leaning Tower of Pizza lean. The Leaning Tower of Pizza is in Italy. Spaghetti, Baba da Booby, meat, balls. I love bush. I love when you can just stick your face inside the bush and just go. <laughs> Women love that. My favorite is when when pubes get stuck between your teeth. Have you ever gone down there and been like, ew. What's something you've done that you're not proud of? I've done a lot of things for $7 that I'm not proud of. Can you at least just tell us one of them? I was a prostitute for $7. My client list includes Bill Maher and Betty White. Betty White paid you for sex? Oh no, I paid her. I'm running out of money. According to the map, he should be close. We are at the climax. This is it. The climax. Everyone loves a good climax. How come you didn't bring shovels or anything? We didn't really care about this president. Whoa, well, look! Oh my goodness. There he is. Oh, oops. Look at that gold chain! Yeah! Yeah! Oh, that was unnecessary. Uh -oh! It's so well preserved! Oh, a javelin! The ice. My neck is so icy that my neck doesn't like me. I feel like a successful rapper. Yeah! Do you want to go to Rick's Pawn Shop and sell this? Sure. Okay.